it's uh, great today to announce the uh, declaration of a priority development area here for Wynnum Creek. Uh, as Planning Minister it's my role to ensure that the communities have the planning instruments that are necessary to deliver the community vision for their, their uh, particular area. Uh, Peter Dowling has long talked about this issue and lobbied me for a declaration to allow the community here to deliver the, the uh, development here that they believe is important for the future. It's great today to be able to say that the PDA for Wynnum Creek has been delivered. It's always great to welcome the Deputy Premier to your electorate and today the announcement of the PDA means we can finally start to put in place the outcomes that the community want. Public open space available to all, ample parking for the island community and tourism attractant, accommodation, residential, restaurant precinct, family friendly area, something that the community will uh, set the direction and help guide the principles between council through the planning instruments and through the state government to deliver finally once and for all on, on Wynnum Creek and make it a, a worthwhile showpiece uh, coastline port rather than what it currently is which is a, a terribly ad hoc and poorly uh, configured location that no one really wants to come to. Fantastic to have a Deputy Premier back here in Redlands and also fantastic that Redlands is now the recipient of two out of the three priority development areas. I think that indicates that not only is Redlands open for business but the partnership we've built in the short time that we've both been in government uh, between state and local government is critical in getting things done in our community. I want to acknowledge the great work done by the uh, Deputy Premier. In fact 12 months ago I visited his office and said Deputy Premier, we need a tool to make these great projects happen. And here we are today, not only with the tool, but with a great result. And I'd like to also acknowledge the great work done by EDQ and the team at Council who's been really focused on making this project. They've all come together and now the hard work really begins. We have a blank canvas and now we need to deliver. Today marks a, uh, a turning point for uh, Redland Bay and the Bay Islands. For a long time, Wynnum Creek has presented a lot of difficulties, particularly with parking issues, and without the state's help, we wouldn't get to a situation where we can have the, this resolved. And as Peter said, there are so many opportunities and uh, so much potential we can achieve out of this Wynnum Creek development site that uh, I think we'll look back in the future and we'll mark today as the day that we finally turned around the Redland Bay and the islands economically and socially.